Is your iPhone touch screen suddenly not responding to your taps or swipes? Don't panic. In this video, I will show you quick and easy fixes you can try at home to bring it back to life. First, let's try a force restart. This can fix temporary glitches that freeze the screen. If you have an iPhone 8 or later, then you can force restart it this way. Quickly press and release the volume up button and then volume down button. And finally press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. For older devices, pause the video and follow the on-screen instructions. If a force restart didn't help, try cleaning the screen. Dirt, sweat or even screen protectors can interfere with touch sensitivity. Use a soft, lint-free cloth, slightly damp if needed and clean the screen thoroughly. Also make sure that your fingers are clean and dry when using the screen. Sometimes, the case or the screen protector might be causing your iPhone touch screen to not work. Remove them and test the screen again, especially if the issue is around the edges. Next, check if your iPhone needs a software update. Bugs can affect touch performance. To check if any updates are available for your iPhone, open Settings and tap on General. Then tap on Software Update and install any available updates. If you can't update your device this way, then you can also restore iOS on your iPhone using iTunes or Finder. Tutorial link on how to do this is given in the description of this video. If your screen is still acting up, consider resetting all settings. This won't delete your data but it will reset system settings like Wi-Fi, Bluetooth etc. and can cause your touch screen to work again. To do this, open settings, tap on general. Then scroll down and tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Then tap on reset and finally tap on reset all settings. Tried everything and iPhone screen is still unresponsive, then it might be a hardware issue. Reach out to Apple support or visit an Apple store for a proper diagnosis. If this video helped you out, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more iPhone tips. Got questions? Drop them in the comments below. Thanks for watching.